Stage is yours. Come on, guys. Okay. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is a day we've been waiting for for a couple of months now. My name is Abraham, and I'm a third year civil engineering student at AUB. Innovation. What is innovation? Products, is it research? What is innovation? Innovation in our eyes is ideas. Ideas that most of us struggle in finding, let alone realizing. Okay, according to the Global Entrepreneurship Monitor, Monitor. Over 100 million businesses are founded annually. Uh, what of these 100 million? A staggering 23% fail. Why, you ask me? These fail due to clashes within the team. These clashes can either be due to conflicts in vision between the team members or just a lack of skills. When it comes to startups, most of us have trouble finding the right people, be it people with skills or people who simply share our ideas. Well, we thought of a plan. We wanted to drive that first step to give an opportunity where ideas can actually have a shot at turning into something great. As you may know, the hardest part of realizing an idea is getting started. And if you're going to go for it alone, Chances are pretty slim that you're going to get anywhere. Well, we made it easier for you. I bring you Founded. Founded lets you find your guy. If you like the set of skills, well, there's a nerdy little JavaScript programmer on the other end just waiting to get his hands dirty. Basically, it's replacing the middleman by, you guessed it, an app. Here's a quick walkthrough. You start off by creating a profile either through Facebook or LinkedIn. Okay. Then on, you enter a page which prompts you to enter your most proficient skills and, of course, your idea. Or if you have a pitch, you can input that instead. Then you swipe on to the next page. Uh, you, uh, a list of characters appear. Uh, you're either a business samurai, marketing guru, design freak, nerdy tinkerer, chatty lawyer, or a piggy bank. Well, you pick one that best describes you. And if you're confident enough, you can choose more than one. Then, uh, after that, you're all set. You swipe on to the next page. You can either choose to find an idea, some idea that may match your interests, or found based on skills. In a matter of seconds, our integrated algorithm will match you with the right guy. Of course, you have the option to reject that match. Uh, in such a case, you'll be rematched with a different person. It's pretty cool, I have to admit. When a match is accepted, Founded will display a list of shared connections for reference. All right. Then on, the matched users will be placed in a private chat room where they can interact via messaging. Our app will be a freemium. Freemium as in free. But for as little as a dollar a month, you can unlock some really cool features. And of course, get rid of ads. These, these features might include highlighting your profile, etc. The greatness in this is in its ease of use and accessibility. At the end of the day, it's an app with a 30 second registration process. And I can guarantee you that in a minute's time, you'd the user would have found what he wanted, be it a mutual idea or a skilled person. Last but not least, I shall address our competitors. The app is one of a kind. Similar generics are, of course, out there. With a pesky registration process uh, in website form, that could take lots of time. And of course, there's an, a very annoying emailing system, which you have to wait for weeks until you get a reply from the, from the actual founder or, or anything. We believe that we can viciously compete with these uh, companies. Founded will provide you push notifications when messaged or matched. Our app, our app is rather 
our app is rather focused compared to others, as it matches you not only with adequate skill, but with similar visions. Finally, I'd like to meet my team, Jad and Nicholas. Jad is a marketing guru, according to our app, and Nicholas is some design freak, and we owe it to him for designing the app. I am sure that me and my team are capable of anything, and I can guarantee a future for Founded. We are currently raising $30,000 to complete our development, and of course, begin our campaign. Founded can help you find, found, innovate. Please feel free to subscribe our Facebook page or our website. Thank you all for coming today. There we go. Come on, guys. Go on stage. Hop, hop. Man, we have, you know, there's people that they get nervous on stage and they start like, <laughs> and there's these people like you that you get nervous on stage and you go like, boom, come on. <laughs> Full of energy, my friend. Okay. <laughs> Judges, questions, please. Yes, first of all, thank you. It's a very interesting idea. We can see a Tinder for uh, jobs. But my question is, uh, what is the key feature, according to you, that will make an HR person within a company go on your app every day and just swipe for better candidates rather than receiving a bunch of CVs to their email? Waiting for the bus to come. <laughs> uh, okay, do you hear me? Hi. So uh, basically, we are t not targeting corporations. We are targeting startups at an early stage. We found uh, with our studies, with, directly with entrepreneurs, that they have this uh, problem to find, idea, to find skilled people, even though there are a lot of skills. So for example, if you compare it to LinkedIn, we're not, LinkedIn is more for corporate solution for employment, where, uh, rather uh, than uh, finding uh, startup skills. It is quite uh, different in terms of uh, startup skills not only require uh, uh, the, sk the regular skills, but also the trustworthiness. Uh, for example, also uh, other things such as uh, uh, same interests, exactly. And how do you gather this information? Like, is there any specific algorithm behind you gathering yes. the data? So uh, with LinkedIn, first, uh, with Facebook, and also the person will uh, have to input uh, his interest at the beginning of the app and the registration process. A question? Um, thanks so much for presenting this, guys. Great presentation. Um, so my question is that, so I understand that this is not meant for uh, HR people, like what you just mentioned. It's meant for like co-founders and smaller teams, right? Now, once you find those initial people, do you feel like people will keep coming back to your platform because you've got a monthly subscription of a dollar, but if I already found my co-founder, would I keep coming back? Well, we're gonna, uh, basically it's the starting point. It's the starting point. So you're looking for, you're looking for a co-founder. You're gonna start there. Well, you're, not, you're probably not going to register for another month, but what we address is a bulk. At, at some point of our lives, we're all going to go through this process. We're all going to go through some midlife crisis. We're going to go and found something, right? No? And then, so if, we t if at least half these people use, use an app, like just go ahead, use the app for, fi for, finding, for finding a co-founder or finding some set of skills, then uh, we have a pretty good chance at... Uh, Racking up some money through that. But no, I do not think that uh, when you subscribe once, you're going to subscribe again. But it's still worth a shot. Can I answer also your question? Uh, so there are 100 million startups started each year or businesses. So if each year you, you have this uh, amount and we get a small uh, an inch of the market, we can just sustain. So if we get 0 0.0001, we'll get 10,000 subscribers. Uh, it is a rough estimation. But uh, you can see that the number uh, projects like uh, huge numbers. Okay, guys. No Thank more you. questions? Thank you very much. Thank you, judges. Thank you, team. Thank you.